when it comes to quality levels in Burgundy, we have to realize that the wines are classified due to their place of origin. The basic level of Bourgogne wines are regional wines. As the word already says, wines are grown in a specific region. But this region can be defined as quite a big area. So there is a label Vin de Bourgogne, and it can be Bourgogne Blanc, which is a burgundy white. It can be Bourgogne Rouge, which is a burgundy red. And the grapes could come from different places all over Burgundy, which stretches over 230 kilometers and has dozens of villages, but the plots are only classified as giving grapes for regional wines. A step higher, and then only 37% of Burgundy wines are village wines. Appellation village. Village wines, as the word already suggests, can come from vineyards located in and around a specific village. On the label of a village wine, you will find the name of a specific village. So, a Côte de Nuit regional wine is of lower level than, for example, a Chambol Musigny from the village Chambol Musigny. A Côte de Beaune regional wine is on a lower level than, for example, a Pomar coming from the village and the surroundings of Pomar. Only 10% of Burgundy wines are Premier Cru wines. Cru is a term that stands for a specific vineyard plot. So we would say it's a single vineyard that is superior to plots that are classified to deliver grapes for Appellation Village. Wines that come from superior single vineyards would always state Premier Cru on the label as well. The last and most prestigious wines of Burgundy on top of the pyramid are Grand Cru wines. 33 single vineyards in Burgundy produce 1% of the entire production are Grand Cru classified. Of the 33 single vineyards in Burgundy that are classified Grand Cru, 60% approximately are red and 40% approximately are white. Another small quiz that you can find on the website of the Burgundy Winemakers Association displays the quality pyramid in Burgundy. On the left-hand side, it would then in random order give the different appellations. So for example, uh, Premier Cru, Régional, Village and Grand Cru. And you will have to place the correct answer on the quality pyramid. Of course, it would then look like this. The absolute top of the top wines, only 1% of production are Grand Cru. The next best level is Premier Cru. Then we have 44 villages that are allowed to classify vineyards around their villages or towns with Appellation Village. So in total, 44 Appellation Village. And we have a couple of Appellation Régional of regional appellations. These include Bourgogne, Blanc, 
Bourgogne Rouge. They also include Côte de Bonne, Côte de Nuit, Côte Chalonnaise. There are also Haute Côte de Bonne and Haute Côte de Nuit and other regional appellations, for example, Maconé. The difficult thing in Burgundy now is to be able to distinguish regional appellations from village appellations and Premier Cru appellations from village and Grand Cru appellations. Of course, you can always look it up in the internet. A big help is also that on the label of a Premier and on the label of a Grand Cru, this will always be mentioned. The average production volume in Burgundy in total are 1.54 million hectoliters annually. 60% of the produced wines are white wines in Burgundy. 30% of the wines produced in Burgundy are red or rosé, but rosé has a very, very small part in this. 11% of the wines produced in Burgundy are sparkling. Sparkling wines in Burgundy are often made of red grape varieties, like in Champagne. So Pinot Noir is used for sparkling wines, but also Chardonnay. Often Pinot Noir and Chardonnay are blended in sparkling wines. The sparkling wines on quality level in Burgundy are called Crémant de Bourgogne. Approximately 50% of all Burgundy wines are marketed as regional appellations, roughly 47% as village appellations, including Premier Cru, and on top of this quality pyramid we find, with 1% of the production, Grand Cru wines. Burgundy is a rather small production area in France. The approximately 30,000 hectares account for 4% of the entire vineyard surface area of France. This means that Burgundy each year delivers of only 3% of the total production volume in France. But it has 4.5% of the quality wines, so AOC-defined wines. Of the entire global wine production, Burgundy makes 0.5%. When we look into percentages and the structure of uh, companies in Burgundy, we see that the structures are very small. The average surface area that a wine estate owns is 6.5 hectares only. The area under production, according to the appellation, looks like this. There is about 50% of the wines that are regional AOCs. About 20% are Chablis and the region Grand Auxerrois. Roughly 13% of the wines come from Côte de Bonne and 6% Côte Chalonnaise, 6% Côte de Nuit and roughly 7% from Maconnet. More than 50% of Bourgogne wines are consumed within France. The exports go to 25% to other European Union countries and to 22% outside of the European Union. In total, more than 200 million bottles of Burgundy wines are sold each year. Of the 200 million bottles, roughly 47% are exported and about 53% consumed within France. The estimated turnover each year with Burgundy wines accounts for 2 billion 
euros.